Hey, hello everybody. Hi, G and Lucky Sixes. Namaste. From Proxy Table Gaming. Indeed. Did you panic there? Did you panic there that you only got one prepared and just went with the classic old Namaste? Or not? Um, no, I, I, I've, been, I've been doing research to increase oh, okay. my... And one was Jambo. But I have Jumbo. no idea what that's from. So I, it sounds, I'm like, sounds like a happy should word. Should I go Jambo? So, you know. Should I go Namaste? And you know what? I feel in Zen. Yeah. Okay, fair so, enough. Well, I'm going I mean, with Zen. Obviously, I don't know if Jumbo is right or wrong, but I think Jumbo Jumbo works better. Jumbo Jumbo. Yeah, hello, yeah. hello. Yeah, well, maybe. Maybe it's not that. But maybe anyway. another time. <laughs> maybe you get a double, a triple hello, kind of, from the... Maybe. Yeah. 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 Anyway, here we are. <laughs> Breakthrough. Number five, Battle Round five against the Sylvan Elves. Oh, no! Who <laughs> tend to be the army that just smash me up all the time. Um, yeah, yeah, whatever what you army, play. I, I am. Um, it, however, it was against Adlake, who we were talking um, the Another previous new noise. New opponent, not played before, and it was it was nice to play him because we, we dodged each other through so many tournaments. Um, mm. So it was nice to actually have a game against him. Um, Great. Even if he is taking something else. Um, yeah, that's, that's unforgivable. However, looking at it objectively and not just my my own personal bias, I do have wretched ones who do. love elves because they yes. always attack. Uh, the issue is, uh, I guess, these guys shoot shoot me off rather than mm -hmm. fight me off, uh, which is a thing. Um, but if they're shooting them off, they're not shooting the, the Chosen and stuff, and he does have a lot of uh, things that can deal with my, all my high armored stuff yeah, yeah, yeah. from range. So, um, just in case, I've got to be super aggressive where I can and hope uh, the combat's going my way. Um, looking at his army, he oh, has I love 27 wild hunts. <laughs> oh, man. Who, That's only 384 points for nine wild hunts. I mean, what it's the? Insane. And they, they've got Sylvan Blades, so they've got four attacks each, strength four. Uh, eight yeah. two, I think, but just it's so oh, it's many four hundred points. It's so many, and agility wise, they go before my chosen, which is seven really on the bad. charge. Yeah. Um. So no, that's a mistake. Surely less than four hundred points for nine hunts. Absolutely not. So he's he spammed them. Uh, they're the real threat, and, and I'm just thinking, what can I do? Luckily, wretched ones are random movement, so he's not going yeah, yeah. to go around me either. So I need to be careful of that. <laughs> Um, but yeah, just oh, let's let's do it. Um, Kestrel Knights uh, can be annoying and there are a lot of points, mm. but will be really hard for me to get because uh, they're so quick. Yeah. Um, two Forest Eagles, um, five points cheaper than High Elves. Well, I um, uh, uh, the same stat line. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. uh, Pathfinders for shooty shooty AP goodness. Um, they can either get plus two yeah. AP or plus two to hit. So. Yeah, they're going to do some work this game. Um, his core, uh, his core is all his scoring. Um, okay. So he has big. A wild huntsman not scoring. No, they're like troops. Oh right. Okay. Um. So there's that. If they were scoring as well, just amazing. Um. But he has okay. big block of archers. Uh. With banner discipline, small block of archers, and two heath riders. Um. Scoring. This is um. But even before we get to the screen, it is capture the flags as well. So yeah. even though they're pretty, my scoring is much uh, tough, tougher than his. Yeah, yeah, yeah. His are much easier to get out the way. Uh, yeah. And spoilers, uh, yeah, we won't mention those Heath Riders again. Um, <laughs> he in his characters, he's got a Cosmo Master, a General Shamanism Adept. Um, and chief well, chieftain with Boa Wiston in the Pathfinders and a chieftain BSB, pretty um, naked for the most part. It's binding the scroll, uh, but don't have too much in the way of complications there. They're just there to add some magic rerolls yeah. and some shooting. So sure. uh, they do the job. But yeah, so uh, I, I didn't know. I, I thought this was a good matchup in terms of my what my wretched ones, but. Mm -hmm. He could just avoid me all game. Was my worry. But it's not that shooty. I mean, it is. It has got some. Range, no, but, but he could not... just avoid me all game. Yes. Yeah. Do yeah. you know what I mean? Like while plinking a little bit. If plink, plink, wise, plink. Yeah. Maybe get one unit. Avoid mm. me. Make it. And that's. I was like, oh man, this is what could happen. Um, mm. 
Frontline Clash didn't have to think and capture the flags, as we said. Um, so this is how we how we do. Um, I deployed uh-huh. first, four first, because I absolutely needed to with his shooting and everything. Um, I put my warriors in the middle, wretched ones either side, and the chosen and the the, the um, <laughs> chosen knights on the hill. So uh, there you go. I, I they like being on hills. Mm, barbarians go behind uh, this block. Um, this impassable, sorry. Uh, Chosen, I thought, could back up into the forest to get some cover if needed. Uh, And I've got a forest over there for some cover from the Chosen Knights if needed as well. Um, From his point of view, and I will move us down, uh, behind the plate um, is his (laughs) Heath Riders. uh, Okay. uh, Which is also an impassable terrain. So, again... Another reason why we won't mention them again. Uh, the other Heath Riders are are in the other corner, so yeah, just not going to stay there. Uh, left to right, he's got uh, Kestrel Knights, Eagle, Pathfinders, Wild Hunt- Huntsman, Wild Huntsman, uh, Eagle in the front, big unit of uh, archers so in the back with the BSB, uh, small unit of archers at the back with both of his casters in, and then some Wild Huntsmen. So okay. Wild Huntsman protecting the things, um, although luckily they are kind of opposite the wretched ones, so mm. I've at least got that. If the wretched ones could go into them, happy days, you know. Uh, yeah. On to... Oh, this is a picture of them. Because <laughs> I may as well get one picture of them, right? Well, you keep saying you're not going to mention them again, and I then know, you mention yeah. them again. I'll, get, so, I'll give them know. the limelight to start off with, and then... Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. Okay. Um, so, uh, the knights on the on the right flank move up uh, so that I minimal go through the forest if I have to charge. Um, What's going on with the wretched ones? They've not gone 18 inches. Well, the ones on the right did a decent amount, but the ones on the left literally went three. It was (laughs) was like, oh, okay, they're not... I I needed it to... (laughs) Come on. (laughs) So because of that, my chosen back off, you know. Um, I want to make sure his kestrels can't get in behind me because I'm not really too fussed about the kestrels, but... um, in the flank of something or in my barbarians, I don't want. So no. Uh, and I mean, like Ad, Ad was saying, like there aren't. He's been making a point over this tournament that there aren't really like real chumps in ninth age at the minute. They're not like so. You go to like a forty k tournament and you lose, and you you get someone that's never played the game before, sort of thing. You sure. don't get that in ninth, and a lot of people know no. what they're doing. Um, and this is an example of it: is that yeah, I've got the tools to get behind you. But no one lets you get behind you, so my chosen were doing Unless exactly that. Unless they make a that. mistake, yeah, yeah. I yeah, I yeah. don't want him to get behind me, so I don't let him mm. get behind me, you know. And the wretched ones really help with that. Uh, but my chosen just angle and back off. Um, they're going to take some shooting, but I don't think he can shoot me all game and get the points. So mm-hmm. that's my my goal there, at least until the warriors come over uh, or yeah. do something. Um, but yeah, I, I mean, pretty spread out. Bar- barbarians go this way because I think. Uh, the chosen knights are going to need more help than the chosen, but I'm within 18 to give them word of iron if, if possible. Yeah, I get spectral blades on the higher um, wretched ones um, for the rerolls to wound. I've, nice. I, I, I've still got whispers of the veil as well, and I thought yes. about this, and I thought because because it worked so well for me, but actually not the leadership. It was the minus one res in the last battle because it was yeah. quite. Uh, but this one, I thought, well, that still actually helps the Wretched Ones because I'll be able to wound on twos. Mm-hmm. And I'm mm-hmm. auto-hitting. So yeah, yeah. if I like roll well, I could have like 24 auto-wounds on twos. Yeah. Which, and they don't have much armor or save or anything. So no, I could, no. I'll just obliterate units. So I stuck yeah. with it um, just to see if 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 that could help uh, as well for the battle, just as an FYI. But that, I only got Spectral Blades off, but I was happy enough with that. I think mm-hmm. he stopped Word of Iron on my Chosen. Sure. Uh, he starts to shoot in and um, shoots, shoots. Uh, kills six, eight wounds with the Wretched Ones. That's uh, pretty good going. Over on this side. Over on this side does four wounds of Chosen. You say, like, the shooting, you yeah, respect yeah. it, man. Uh, maybe. Uh, but, um... My t- and, and I think we it. missed his movement actually, but yeah. Uh, so we'll, he's we'll found out here. Mm. Uh, so um, in t- we'll talk about both movements in his movement as well. Uh, after the shooting, um, he just sort of like fans out his mm. wild huntsman uh, for some count charges, and so they get close. Uh, luckily for me, 
um, his my Richard one's sort of run up this time. Yeah, um, Richard one's on the right move up so that he can't charge past them to get into my chosen into the knights. knights. Yeah, so I'm really happy with that, and the eagle can do what he wants. Um, my Richard one's on the left move up. I push him towards the center because I'm like, you know what? I don't think I'm going to catch much, but the arches I can catch. So yeah. um, I want him to think about that. Um, it was a, a, a relative mistake, and I'll see if you can spot it. Um, do, 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 do. Uh, so this is after your turn, though, isn't it? Mm -hmm. So you've moved up. I've moved well, your mistake or his mistake? My mistake. Which could have, like, it was a, a slight one, and I didn't see it at the time of, the, of this. I suppose but, his, so his huntsman we'll, could go into your warriors, maybe, but... Uh... We'll pause it there for people, and if people want to <laughs> think, we'll yeah, come to, come have to that later. More, but more I have made a slight mistake, potentially, here. Um, mm, okay. In his turn, he charges them, his wild oh. huntsman, into my wretched ones. And, um, I mean, okay. he's likely to kill them, but Which I'm is fine. To kill him. I... Yeah, because you'll have twelve attacks back, wounded on, well, threes. Well, I don't have twelve. I have d six plus four. Oh, of course you do. Yeah, four d six plus four. So I'm, um, you know, it could yeah. be anything. It could be twenty eight. You know, yeah. and I'm wounded on threes. He doesn't have much armor. Only has a six yeah. save. I've only got new nine wounds overall, and I'm pretty sure I can do that. Um, yeah, and then the way is clear for the chosen knights so to mop I'm, up. I'm like, okay. Um, yeah, I'll, I'll make that trade. Uh, he does. He does obviously win in points wise, um, mm -hmm. uh, but it yeah, that's a, ridiculous. It clears a massive um, thing for me that the chosen couldn't, you know, chosen knights could do without. So that's really good. Yeah. Um, and on here, he does a double charge into them again. Okay, going into my war, my my wretched, wretched ones, ones where i'm that's exactly the matchup i won um he was saying at the start but uh i guess from his point of view though this goes back to my mistake and i'll uh see if i've got an overview of his things so he gets in and he gets in um yeah and it's at this point that the mistake might be a bit clearer um but it's, mm. uh the wild huntsman on the left have an overrun yeah. uh into the flank of my warrior unit it's not going to be many left. I don't think you're bothered um, by that. Well, most of my things have to go forwards. So it's that unit most, on the left but... that could... But yeah, I mean, that's... You it, still it... have 2d6 plus 2 on the ones on the left. Yeah. That could still... Um, and again, I'm just spike, hoping that they no? don't do 18 wounds. They do have a lot, though. They do have a lot yeah. of attacks. It's like 40-odd attacks. <laughs> um, I mean, on, on average, you've got nine, hit nine wounds, wounding on threes. Yeah. So, you know, you're still killing... With only a six up save, you're still killing four or five of them. Yeah. But I mean, um, I don't think you're bothered about four wild huntsmen going into your flank. Well, that, it'd be annoying, especially as my lord is on yeah. the other side. It's, it's So he'd kill, actually, I mean, you say that four going into my flank is 16 attacks. It's sure. Four AP2, and then potentially, like, uh, granted, I would have, I should you'd be, win. You'd just, and I should yeah, kill you'd him, step faster than He would have killed me, then, yeah. killed a chunk of them, and then just being able to shoot. True them. enough. So, true enough. Um, if there is a mistake from my part, it's that it's that for sure. But okay. otherwise, I'm. I mean, it, yeah, he, he should blow through them both. But I should yeah. have counter charges as well. And if he does go for that, and he needs like an eleven. If he goes for that and doesn't get it, I've got a really nice charge with my chosen. Yeah, um, yeah. As well. I can't remember whether the Wild Huntsmen are fearless. I think they are. It rings a bell. Yeah. Um, but either way. Uh, that's how it looks. Uh, he, he sort of fans out a bit on the left, puts his pathfinders on the hill so he can shoot some stuff, uh, and we go from there. Uh, he gets two buffs on them, I think through Cosmo and like plus one strength and things. I'm not too bothered because I'm going to attack and it's not a defensive buff. No. So um, I'm, I'm, I just, that's, fair, that's fine from my point of view. Uh, he shoots my barbarians. And does like ten wounds or something. Gosh, uh, nine wounds, and I'm like, is that a bit of a volley fire going on? There? Oh, oh yeah, yeah. And it's only just. It's like the slightest. I was going to say thing. that that one on the left just sees it's, them, can he? It is the slight, and we measured it, and it's the the millimeter of the millimeters. Um, wow. And but yeah, both. But it still means forty two shots can shoot him. The pathfinders do as well, and uh, so Gosh. it's not actually that bad considering the amount of shots I actually have. No, on, yeah. On me, but. It then does then ring a bell that actually 
that is a fragile barbarian unit. <laughs> Um, yeah, and I yeah. need to be careful of that. And it's scoring as well, so mm. maybe I should have put my uh, wizards in the warriors and had barbarians at the back, out the way, you know, sort of thing. So maybe interesting. Um, a bit more shooting goes and it continues the pain. Um, nice, uh, nice barbarians. Yeah, not, nice bench got that. Yeah, yeah. Nice yeah. I'm liking them, but they're all dead. Um. Speaking of all dead, um, all my ritual ones are dead, and I kill eight of the nine. Um, nice, yeah. And uh, if I'm honest, that's fine. He does overrun, uh, okay. though, with it on that. Over here, he doesn't okay. do hardly anything. I mean, uh, I think I actually remember he does pretty below, like slightly below average on all his hits and stuff. And then I roll eleven out of nineteen five ups. Right. Which yeah. Which just means I lose eight, uh, or whatever it is, might be with it, and and then there's a few yeah. more with horses, I think. But it means he's stuck there. There is no chance of an overrun, and I am the chosen are coming in. Chosen. And as well, I it's it's a seven then to sure. overrun into the pathfinders. So nice. I'm looking pretty pretty. And... Could he have reformed? No, he couldn't. I was going to say, could he shuffle his unit further up the line? But he can't do that, can he? And he d and he wouldn't want to move him up that way because then it makes be the overrun easier. less. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Overrun, yeah. So, um, and it's at this point he goes, ah, oh, that's probably the game, isn't it? And we were, oh, okay. And I was like, uh, okay, well, it, it, yeah. Anyway, well, I might. You can have a turn, and I might shut your hand. Like, no, no, don't, because I haven't got actually that many points because they're not worth that much. <laughs> yeah, you've still got a whole back line to get to. Um, yeah, but what it did mean is that I had a. A lot of options and stuff. So we played it out a bit more. Uh, I uh -huh. obviously got the chosen in. Uh, I think I needed a five. Yeah. I think. Or I, it might have been auto because of the champion. Uh, I needed uh, an eight to get in here as well. Because, you didn't go into the huntsman. Well, I was like, I could get one extra huntsman or I could go for. If I get that, he's got his archers and his two, his general. Wizards and, and, and wizard. Yeah. So, I mean, that's that really is the game if I get in it's there. It's juicy, yeah. Uh, I take. Uh, just get rid of him there. I don't get in with the chosen knights, mm. which is annoying. Um, yeah, because now it's at this point that we go. Actually, yeah, there is some options that yeah, they can the, just get away for the Sylvans. Uh, but I do get in over here, and as you can see, it's like a seven to get into the Pathfinders. Um, overall, my barbarians move up to make it really hard to be um, qualified. Qualified. Uh, but I charge and overrun uh, because I feel... <laughs> and now it's less hard for Volifier. less hard for Volifier, but if he stands there in Volifier, I've got yeah, these yeah, big yeah. units. So yeah. uh, there's that as well. And I, I should have a decent chunk over here. Um, my Richard ones go down, but so do all of his Wild Huntsmen. My Richard ones, my three Richard ones killed the front ones. My Chosen killed the side. Nice. Uh, I have an overrun, but Gosh, I... Gosh, that, that was cool. Um, okay. So uh, this is the last picture, though. Okay. Um, because we do call it here, we just add up points and such. So what we decide is I'm not going to get anything on the left-hand side because he's just going to move around. Dance around you, yeah. Um, mm -hmm. Equally, though, he's probably not going to get the Chosen because um, uh, he's going to, you know, if he goes yeah, yeah, in, not enough he's not going to fight them with anything. And no. one unit of Pathfinders isn't enough to plink them. It's a lot, but it's not enough to plink no. them over the whole game. And it, also, if I could go on the hill, I have some other charges. It's likely that he's moved away. So we just say, you know what, we'll call it a draw over there. You don't get anything, I don't get anything. Mm -hmm. um, okay. In the middle, uh, he has enough space to move his both his, gen uh, his um, Wizards, masters Druids. out of line of sight of the uh what's it called the chosen knights which is a real yeah. it's just like and again it's millimeters whatever but we're like okay he moves up his um uh archers to chaff them um which yeah you know, might be good might be bad but uh, obviously we i haven't got the heath riders I mentioned them again no um and i probably don't get that single wild huntsman because he's too maneuverable um, we say that he gets the barbarian unit, but not the art, uh, the things, because he'll be able to plink away with just the left hand unit um, and stuff. Could, uh, could oh, because so this is uh, you didn't do his shooting phase. No, then. this is the last picture of what we did. Right. Okay. Um, so what ends up happening is I get the so and he moves his BSB to there, as you can see as well. So yeah, yeah, yeah. So I get the thirty archers, I get the small archers, uh, and one of his his master um, 
panics off the board after the archers die. Oh, okay. Right, fair enough. Six. Um, the other well, one... So you gave up the barbarian points then? Yeah, yeah, yeah. So, okay. but I win the objective because I've got two score into it. Is one, he's not going to get my three. Um, yeah, sure. And, okay. And that's what we do. So, so he, he manages to actually save a lot of points so I don't get as much as what I would have got if the Chosen Knights had got in on an ancient yeah. throw. Yeah, oh, absolutely, yeah. <clears throat> Excuse me. Um, and obviously the same with the Chosen on the left. Uh, so mm. a few... Uh, I, I need like a seven, roll like a five, you know, sort of thing. And yeah, yeah. I need an eight. So if those go in, I get like an easy 20 and he calls it there. But because I didn't, we had a talk about it and we said, you know what? And it was the last game. I wasn't too bothered. Um, mm. it, it was a nice game. It was really friendly. Ad's a really, yeah, really good yeah. guy. Uh, it was really nice to chat to him and stuff. Uh, and he wanted to go off. And I, yeah. And, but I did think it wasn't quite a 20. Uh, and yeah, it was yeah, really. Yeah. Um, so, yeah. Sure. So we added it up. And I got a fifteen. Okay. okay. Day day two did the job. Yeah. Really. Um, I mean, points aren't that different, really, are they? So no. You know. And it was because I mean, he got uh, both wretched ones for a thousand, um, yeah. and the barbarian. Oh, I guess I did give him the uh, wizards as well because of. Well, that's what I was thinking because they have like three up yeah. armor. So no, they don't. They only have six. Up. Do they? Oh. Yeah. Yeah, yeah okay, they've got nothing. Enough. That's why I don't put them in the warriors because actually they're not. They would die straight yeah. away. Um, well, that, that was that was my only concern. We're giving the barbarians. Is I think the sorcerers might have survived on one or two wounds, but uh, yeah, um, still. But I mean, it's got the, it basically he moves the pathfinders. He doesn't go against the chosen, so that he goes against the barbarians. Okay. And yeah, fair enough to, to make sure. And of I mean, it, yeah. he killed what eleven in one round, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. and he's got three rounds of shooting. So I'm like. You know what? I guess, and you wouldn't have been able to catch him. So yeah, and, fair it, enough. and if I wanted to charge the archers, which I did with the warriors, then I wouldn't mm -hmm. have got been able to put the uh, wizards anywhere else. Yeah, sure. So there was okay. that as well. So it's a, a really quick game. I, I was left with mm. an hour and fifteen of these shorter rounds as well. Oh, um, always nice for round so, five. Uh, yeah. So yeah, I mean, all my games are really, really quick. It was really nice against Ad as well. We had a lot of chatting the night before and chatting, obviously, when we were playing as well. Um, mm. uh, I I think it was a mistake to go into the Wretched Ones with his Wild Huntsman. It was real... what you wanted, really, wasn't it? Yeah. yeah. They were a real threat to all my other units. Um, yeah. And that was the one that I wanted. So, uh, But he, he wanted to do it to... Because he said he said the trade off is good, um, because because they're so cheap, like yeah, they're so that's, cheap. That's so good. I mean, I get they're not scoring fair enough, but they're light troops because of that, and Mate. I think that's an even exchange points wise. I, I was expecting honestly they'd be at least five hundred points each. Yeah. So, um, so uh, I, I mean, from myself, from my, my point of view, I was really happy to get two big mm -hmm. wins. Um, or this is like a medium win, I guess. Um. So that took me to 50 points exactly. Okay. Um, All right. Well, that's a salvage job then, really. It, was, it really was. It was a, a, a take and run sort of thing, which should should have meant I was on uh, sort of 50 points and for the mm -hmm. thing, uh, which would have been an increase of like 15. Um, however, loads of people got like 51 to 55 <laughs> uh, as well. So I should have took the 20. Um, but yeah. Uh, but it meant that I was everyone. slightly lower than I, I. I think I finished out thirty six. I think I finished twentieth. Okay. Uh, thirty eight. Sorry. I think I finished twentieth. So I was like just below halfway. It was like forty eight or forty seven or something. Uh, so I got about eight extra points. But it was extra points for the masters. So um, it has improved on your bias in... tournament. Uh, yes, which was the goal. Um, and <laughs> after day one, I'm very happy to do any yeah. sort of improvement. Uh, on, um, on on that on that tournament as well. So uh, job kind of done, and I kind mm -hmm. of got even. Um, uh, didn't get three wins, which is always a, a thing I like to get. No, well. but the one of them was a nine, which is you know close. Yeah, exactly. So, so it, it, Paul will call it a draw. Uh, yeah, it was anyway, exactly, sure. yeah. Um, but yeah, so that leaves me uh, in. After this, there is one single day tournament, uh, which shouldn't give too many points, shouldn't affect too much. Um, but overall, I'm now in 16th place Ooh, uh, in so the rankings. 13th to 16th. So went from 13th to 16th. I am on, uh, let's just get the points. Um, I am on 283, so I gained eight points okay. out of it yeah. uh, in terms of that. Um, but by 
point naught two, I leapfrog Gu- Guillaume, uh, mm-hmm. and by three points, uh, I'm higher than Tony. So there's a load of people. I would have finished twentieth if I didn't go to this tournament. Right. So yeah, it was. So it was, it every, showed you needed to boost your score a bit then. Every little helps, and I think I think overall, really, from this whole endeavor and the whole my whole point of of doing this is that. If you go to enough tournaments, anyone mm. can get to Masters. Yeah, like, yeah, yeah. You don't even need to win a tournament. I d- no, you I just didn't... need four out of your overall tournaments I to have been all right. I yeah. haven't podiumed in any in any tournament yet. I'm 16th. I'm not quite in it, but with a few mm. better results, if I got 55 points in this one, I would be. I, I would be. Mm. So, um, it just. Yeah, like it, I'm glad I went. I'm glad I give it a go as well. Um, I I, I really think this is a really good list um yeah in yeah. terms of fighting and stuff um but it, a few few battles just didn't go my way at all if i'm honest i think you're missing a bit of range magic and i think yeah. you're missing a I tiny so. bit of chaff um, um yeah potentially if i buff up the or give a little bit of armor to the alchemy guy to the warriors i don't need the barbarians so i can get some chaff in that one I, th- I think um, you're missing your fallen, your light troops fallen. You set up so many good counter yeah, maybe, with yeah. chaff. I think so, one of your strong points is how you use your chaff mm. to set up um, bad things for your opponent. I think you haven't got that in this list. So, sure. if I if I if I'm genuinely honest, I fear this list. And I get it's Tanker's list, so Tanker obviously it's an it's an amazing list. Yeah, so not, yeah. Not, oh, not yeah, by that. the way, he but won the tournament. Of course he did. With his <laughs> version list, but so. I, I fear this list a lot less than I fear your old list. Mm. That's just me, but hey. Oh well, yeah. let us know in the comments what what you think of improvements of this list. Um, mm. are. So, I mean, that's yeah, that's sort of it. Tanker did add some chap as well, so the, the points are very valid. All right, okay. Yeah. Um, so oh, yeah, um, yeah <laughs> I didn't yeah. know that. <laughs> no, I know. Uh, but yeah, he won it um, uh, as well. So well done to him. He he, he ended up on four hundred points. Oh, the it's maximum a, it's, a, get, it's so. a quality seat. I mean, he's cementing himself as numero uno there, hasn't he? Yeah. Um, um, so obviously we'll, going into the Masters. So. Yeah, big congrats to him because that is quite a feat. Um, and mm, yeah, he is. just needs to win the Masters now and uh, yeah. do it all that way. Uh, but yeah, no, it's... Um, uh, I really enjoyed the tournament. A really nice atmosphere. Uh, from my point of view, I I really didn't have to think much. Uh, and I, no. I, I, I come back, five tournaments in a weekend is... A, oh, sorry, five games in a weekend is a lot. Uh, but yeah, six I, including practice, yeah. I did find myself very not mentally drained, like I am Good. sometimes as well. So it was quite a nice uh quite yeah. nice feeling really. Um Good. Uh, so if you want if you just want to go to a tournament just to see people, take Warriors, man. Yeah. <laughs> yes. Yeah, they are Absolutely. easy. Mode. Um I did yeah, I yeah. felt overall I was a bit disappointed that I didn't get the results uh, that I quite I thought I should. Uh, even the, the matches that I lost, I mean, Matty's one, he just outplayed me. Um, mm-hmm. In the in the KOE one, I just they were just too strong. Mm-hmm. They just had too many, and that I guess is Wes's list building. Um, yeah, sure. He really, he really knows the army. Really knows. Yeah, he, he he squeezed every and, last drop of synergy um, and every last drop yeah, of everything absolutely. out of that and, list. Uh, yeah. And I think it was a bad matchup. So I don't think I don't think I was ever really gonna win it, but. Mm. Um, but there was, you know, I, I could have fluked a win sort of thing. But I, I to lose that heavily was a bit yeah, harsh. Yeah, yeah. it's a blow. Considering I was against a cavalry list and I flanked and reared him. You know, mm-hmm. it was just like... I, I oh, don't bring yourself back to that. Managed to you, do you, that. That but... horror show. <laughs> no, but that's what I mean. So, like, they were just they were just too strong. I think in the ID, um, if the Chosen perhaps do a bit better. Although they did very well day two, so I can't complain too much. Um, so I, I think it's very possible that I get a few more points um, and, and put myself up at the, uh, but overall yeah it was a good tournament and I salvaged it for sure that's definitely yeah definitely the, does yeah definitely yeah. the um, the theme definitely and um, just as a comparison in terms of masters and rankings points I went to three tournaments ended up 49th ranked mm. which is fine considering I didn't go to a tournament for the last four months of the year yeah and I only hit three so it shows you that if you do actually just go to four tournaments, no matter where you finish, you could still be in the top 30, 40 of the rankings. Yeah, because, absolutely. Um, you know, so it's, it's worth getting to those four tournaments. That's probably a, an overall life goal of mine is to get to four tournaments. I mean, whether or not I ever get close to Masters <laughs> is another thing entirely. But um, 
yeah, for next year, I'll, I might try and hit four tournaments as my overall Definitely, goal. Man. Yeah, see where and that I takes mean, me. Uh, regardless of the actual gameplay and things, it's it's a great scene, and like there's mm. such good lad. Again, we went out for that curry on the the, yeah. the Saturday night, and there was yeah. twenty of us. Yeah, um, good stuff. You know, and they're they're all they're really nice to chat to. We we were chatting about this a lot actually over the weekend, mm. just saying how like you get to there was maybe four or five new people at this tournament as well, yeah, which yeah. is really great to see. Mm. Um, sort of shout out to War Geordie's Waf, Wafter uh, YouTube channel <laughs> um, awesome. and uh, Craig McKinney who won the Best Painted as well. Um, nice. sort of, he's not new, but like um, yeah, going to not many tournaments and stuff and starting to come out the, mm. the thing. But uh, yeah, really nice to see people um, uh, and chat to them and uh, find out what's what's going on in their lives as well. And it was, yeah, it was a really good social occasion, if nothing else. Yeah, um, yeah. That's what we always say, isn't it? That uh, if you're a player who's been watching these battle reports for a while, never come to a tournament or anything, you really have nothing to fear from the people you're going to meet there. Yeah. Just come and have some fun because everyone is so welcoming. And yeah. we all just have a laugh, don't we? I, I think, mean, that's uh, how we began. So Yeah, Luke Moffat was another one that was new that came along. Mm -hmm. And so it was nice to see him as well, meet him as well. Yeah, definitely. Yeah, and obviously, obviously, we've got the Masters in in January and a, a, a tournament in between that and Masters. But then we got Art of War in February, and if you Art ever wanted to come to a fun tournament, yeah, where as a newbie you're going to be properly welcomed and have a good good time, then Art of War is the place to be. Just, Absolutely. Yeah, yeah, superb. But yeah, right. so um, I need a few dropouts. Uh, oh yes, Masters. that was the um, other thing, wasn't it? Uh, if, you, if those who are 1 to 15, maybe not the auto qualifiers, but if 1 to 15, if you could let me know uh, your address, then I will arrange for some sniper to come take mm -hmm. you out uh, on behalf of Lucky Sixes. It's fine. you know. I mean, it's drawn out of the hat, so you won't all do it. No, so not all of you will couple, die. Yeah. Yeah, so the order is in your favour. Exactly. A few of the snipers might miss too. So there you go. Um, you know, um, yeah, that would be great. <laughs> and then we could get lucky tickets to Masters. Yeah, which would be <laughs> great. I'd be so out of my depth. It's unbelievable. Yeah. But, um, I mean, if you want to go even more extreme, then I could take out all 48 of the people above me and maybe I'll be at Masters. Yeah. It'd be expensive though, wouldn't it? <laughs> it would be um, a bit, yeah. We'd, we'd contract, definitely yeah. need you to get onto our Patreon for that. Oh, definitely. That's a good good <laughs> little tie-in there. Yes, do that. Um, if but you yeah. want to see Lucky Sixes at Masters, <laughs> then sign up to our Patreon and we'll, we will we'll put do our a, money to good We'll do use. a special sniper tier. Yes, absolutely. We'll mm -hmm. do a video. Oh, that's a bit more. <laughs> anyway, we don't need to kill them. We just need to maim them to not be available in January. Oh. Yeah. Right, cool. We're still recording, right? Oh, uh, <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, Sweet. Uh, do check us out on all the social media, especially yeah. um, during the Masters time. There'll be so much out. Yes. And it's not just us as well. We get so many mm. other people involved. Um, yeah, yeah, there's normally yeah. about 10 different um, uh, content providers. So it's that's it, it's really an amazing time. Um, and yeah, it's, yeah. watch some night page, right? Uh, right. And talk about it. So... Um, Check us out on Twitter, uh, at lucky 6 is PTG. Uh, we're on Facebook, which is PTG, Proxy Table Gaming. Um, all the forum, so we're lucky 6 is and Hyper G on the forum. Uh, and, of course, you're on YouTube, so like, share, subscribe. Uh, hit all the buttons everywhere, um, apart Beautiful. from the thumbs down. All the thumbs up, just the thumbs up. Yeah, 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 um, all the other buttons. And, uh, I mean, I guess we're, we're relatively close to Christmas, right? So, Merry Christmas! Yeah, right. <laughs> a few weeks away. Uh, we will, we will yeah. have a couple more uh, bits of content and videos out for you before yeah, then. Yeah, yeah. Uh, yeah. Tend to have like a two week break uh, over yeah. the Christmas period, but um, we I mean we've got masters coming up, so that might be mm, short lived. Might be a long break. Yeah. Sweet, excellent. I am looking forward to all of it. Great. Thank you, Lucky Sixes. Let's roll into the next fun thing. Absolutely. <laughs> See you later.